It is Tuesday the 16th of July 2019. I have just been to a meeting with the Chief Constable of Northumbria. Uh, it was uh, uh, an invite for all the candidates to have a meeting with them, um, not with any of the other candidates uh, present. Uh, so it was just to um, for, for each of us to be able to raise any issues, uh, talk to them about uh, matters of uh, common interest and so on. I actually found it a very interesting meeting, um, which does throw some light on uh, some of the things that they're involved with, uh, but also uh, we managed somehow to get onto a discussion about the rural economy and rural areas and uh, crime issues that affect uh, of, um, uh, affect those communities. Uh, so I was able to talk about uh, my experience uh, of uh, the rural economy and uh, they found that quite interesting, quite useful because I was talking about uh, things like uh, um, beehives uh, being uh, stolen almost almost to order but uh, certainly uh, large quantities of uh, or large numbers of uh, beekeepers have experienced uh, uh, their hives being stolen um, and it's not something that, that um, the chief constable uh, was particularly was particularly on his radar screen uh, so he's quite interested in that um, also interested in uh, how um, you know, the rustling of animals of livestock uh, uh, it's um, you know, that that needs addressing as well. Uh, so, um, on the whole, I have to say that that was a, quite a useful meeting, and uh, we had uh, <laughs> just a few, few chats about uh, uh, what will happen if, by some bizarre fluke, uh, I win. Uh, so, I know there's a conference that uh, PCCs are having next week, uh, which I might have to go to uh, if I won. Um, and uh, I was able to have a bit of a giggle about all of this because uh, it's all sort of like a fantasy uh, world where uh, uh, winning this PCC election, uh, I don't know whether it's fantasy or nightmare for me personally, but uh, we had a, uh, a, a, a sort of amusing chat about uh, what a um, Jonathan Wallace PCC would be like. Anyway, right, that's all um, done now, so I'm going to head home, and I have got quite a bit of casework to catch up with. Well, it's about two o'clock in the afternoon, and I'm about to head off down to Wickham to deliver about 500 of these.